Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Zips, and welcome back to Wild Frost. We we are just gonna keep on trunking with truck trunking trucking with a bunch of friendly goobers mod. This mod's great. It is currently uh two in the morning as I'm recording this. I usually record these. Well, I did already record a video like today at at the time I usually do, which is like when I wake up. Usually one of the first things I do in my day is recording. But I want to try pushing for some d double upload days to make up for the make up for the time I was away. So this recording, me recording when I have energy right now, is going to be my push to make that happen. Alright, I remember like having a brief look at the this set of leaders last time. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Add two bone needles to your head. Apply... So bone needles are apply teeth to question mark, question mark, question mark, equal to damage dealt. Gain two attack before attacking. Zoomlin critical consume. God, I don't want to do a teeth plan. <laughs> we got bucket. Add three, add one crystal, one hit deal damage equal to... Honestly, I think I want to play question mark, question mark, question mark. It is Teeth, and Teeth is scum. Teeth builds are scum. But... This seems like it could be, like, okay early. Because you this is, like, it's, like, four attack you're able to put on this if you're using... Get, if you get off critical, which... Or four Teeth you're able to put on question mark, question mark, question mark here. Which is quite a bit. You know, what if I name this leader? What if I what if I threw my hat in the ring? What if this What if this unit here doesn't have a name? What if I'm the one that gives this this person a name? What if I were to do this? I will na I, I'm gonna name so going off this design. For the name Bone Zelda comes to my, or what, Bone, Bone, Bonelda comes to my mind as Bonelda. So, um, ah, did I, do ah, why not? Why not? We are... I don't know, it, this might be a breach, <laughs> this might be a breach of what I'm like supposed to do also you did see correctly i did click spike here i'm feeling re very spiky today we got we're, we're like double teeth units surely oh shit you're on a you oh wait fuck <laughs> your effect doesn't happen until you go off well that's not good <laughs> oh this was not looking great Okay, we got our bone needles. And they have zoom one, which is interesting. God, you can actually, like... This is interesting. You can actually, like, use this to pump a ton of... Yeah, because then I get double critical here. And then I also just... Both of these get attacks off. I mean, like, doesn't look too bad. I got fucking bone elda here. Bone Elda here is like fucking going off with with nine teeth, and you know what? Then like I just Bone Elda with the fucking. All right, I'll just go for regular attacks here. I am. We are fucking space truck in here. Actually, um, let's spike take this hit because I want to try to save at least one hit of block for the, this big wave. Yeah, we're gonna let all these units fucking hell i have look at all this teeth i have is is today fine do we finally get to do the teeth build is today the day i feel like i i feel like i say this every single time we have like any kind of build that has like any like remote teeth generation is today the day we finally get to do a teeth build and then, like, the subsequent, like, answer is fuck no, because bone, 
I though like having two these two attacks here is quite strong. Whenever Bone Elda ever gets to gets to attack, it's not. It's pretty damn good. Definitely down to take two Frozen Travelers here. Pinkberry. Oh my God! What if it today is the day we finally today? I pre. I claim as the day. We already saw Inca Bomb yesterday. The mode sounds actually quite nice here because we have both of these free attacks. These free item plays with Bonelda. So I'm able to get so Demona's ability to apply demonize when you we hit a unit with an item can actually we, we have good access to it. So I think it's a reasonable play. Infested one Momo. Summon. I don't think we're going to be getting much use out of it. Gain attack equal. Gain attack to self and allies equal to HP loss. Ah, God. See, this is the problem with fucking teeth builds. They feel really limiting. Like, I got fucking Bone Elda here. Then, like, what am I supposed to do with it? Or, like, how do. How do I get these other units to combo with the strategy? I think I just get out, like, fucking this unit Momo. And maybe it'll be okay. I don't feel great about it, though. Don't feel too great about it. I gotta be real. And unfortunately, I don't have anything here that allows Bonelda to attack quicker. <laughs> I gotta admit, I feel a bit weird. I feel like I'm na- So, I don't do this, cause I- the, re the reason I always name, like, my leaders, well, my leaders, is because in my eyes, they're, like, unnamed- They're basically unnamed characters, because even though they, like, technically already have, like, auto-gen- Like, auto-generated names. In my eyes, they are, like- they're characters that, like, they're like blank canvases that I can assign a name to. But now, this character, question mark, question mark, question mark here, uh, is not like that. But, like, question mark, question mark, question mark, ain't exactly a name. And you know what, maybe this is like a thing where, where like the the mod creator hasn't actually assigned a name to the character yet, so it's just question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. So what? It, maybe I'm the one. Maybe it is my doing that will get this character the name Bonelda. Also, I did just let this goblin run away like a fucking moron. I'm so poor. I'm like I'm so caught up in this. I'm I'm lost in the sauce. The sauce is lost on me. But like, look at this! Look at all this fucking... Look at all this teeth we have! This... This has to be good, right? I'm gonna cry. My ass is like, this has to be good. Bitch. We're playing fucking teeth build. Oh, wait, you think I can use, like, a fucking lumen base on Bonelda? And it will give me... Okay. Also, yeah. Okay, Bumbo, get fucking teethed. Alrighty, let us continue. We are omega poor for this shot, man. Yikes. Man. I feel like I've been getting gotcha pumper in this mod, and, like, it has not been, like, good ever. And I've gotten it twice. <laughs> like, weirdly, I'm getting setups where I don't want to play Gotcha Pumper. It's strange. I honestly think I'm going to take my take Sunlight Drum here, just because it gets Bonelda to, a, like, trigger quicker. I don't know if that's good, though. I already have two cards that are triggering her in Sugar Shine and Kekfez. I honestly don't think I'm going to click any of these. It's fucking... It is bizarre. It, it is... It's bizarre. 
You know what? No, no, I'm gonna... Although, if I don't take anything here, it means my deck is smaller and I can pay, play Pink Berry Juice more. I feel like I'm assigning myself onto the Struggle Bus today. I think I'm gonna take the Charm here. Over the item. Try to roll for a good Charm. Bomb Skull Charm? Quite good on the Sentient Punching Bag. Holla. Apply one haze. Gain either weaponized nightshade or special tomatoes to your hand. Deal two self damage. Deuce attack by two. Apply three poison zoomlin. Increase attack by three. Zoomlin consume. Weaponized nightshade seems crazy. Just reducing attack. I think I'm going to take this unit here, Tala. This sounds pretty good. Wait. Wait, what if I was actually supposed to pick Lupa there? And we got a fucking goofy setup where, like, Lupa was hitting Bonelda. Or would this be, like, Bonelda as, like, the way I spelled it? I like reading this as bo Bonelda, but I guess the way I spelled it is, like, Bonelda. I don't know. We're fucking, we're fucking riding OCs out here. On hit, apply teeth equal to damage dealt to all allies. But what if I didn't take that? Oh, man, I really wish I could take Weakening Wind Chime here. This actually seems so good. Wow, God, I really wish I had more money, man. I really wish I had more money. Ugh. The disasters of... The chronic disasters of playing fucking Teeth builds. Alright, we're gonna put a crown on Tala. So, let's see how this goes. My prediction... Help me. <laughs> Although Tala here against Bamboozle, it is kind of just like a horrific mismatch for Bamboozle here. Which is definitely good. I'm gonna give HP to bon Bonelda. Bonelda. Bazinga. Good job, me. The shotgun to the face is Winter Worm. Just kind of try to weaken it down. Eh, I guess it doesn't do too much. Ooh, weaponized nightshade here. What do I do with this? Alright, now what I need to do here, I need to try to... I will... You baseball bat the grouchy. And then that gets you a kill on the whole board. So we can get out sentient punching bag. Uh... It's a good turn. It's definitely a good turn for Kekfez. And then we're able to get the criticals off here. Which is exactly what you're looking for. I, it, it certainly is interesting. It certainly is interesting. Uh, we'll play this here. God, it is unfortunate, because, like, I have to, like, actually set up these hands. Special tomato. Sure. Because I gotta set up the hands where, like, Bonetta actually gets to- gets the teeth off. Which is not very easy. Uh, I could set up a good triple kill here, and I definitely feel like I should. Because, like, I- we are sorely lack- we are sorely- Because I'm not really thinking of money, I'm thinking about fucking teeth maxing this run like a moron. I should absolutely take Spike out of this build. Spike was just a funny pick. Spike, Spike was just me trying to be funny. And in Wild Frost, I don't like being funny. I hate- I hate fun. Alright, we'll recall Tala. So I think I'm just here. I want to focus on trying to make the deck as small as possible. 
so we can like play out the bone needle so we can get like try to consistently get critical on these bone needles i have fucking 13 teeth on bone elda here and it probably is not going to be that good into the late game <laughs> definitely gotta put like lumen base on bone elda here but then we get like a hand like this where it's kind of crazy. Wait a second, with Demonize, actually, I'm starting to think if we get the Mona on the board, we're able to get fucking, cr with the Demonize, we're able to get crazy, a crazy amount of output on the, um, on the Bone Needles. So I should be playing this on Demona. This might be like, the Dem this might be the Demona setup. This might, I, I'm 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 dead serious, honestly. With this setup here, oh, I really wish I didn't have Spike and Tala in the build, or Spike. More specifically, I wish I didn't have Spike in the build, because I want to click this new one, Sun Bell, because it means playing the Bonelda's Bone Needles is gonna be e easier. Moomlin, Sunbell. Let me think. Although I can't just play. No, I should take critical here. I should take critical here for pink berry juice. Okay, thankfully I will be able to buy a crown here. Um, guys, we're fighting spice mocos. Oh no. No oh, fuck. Oh, it all comes crashing down. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, all I have for that is Demona. Ugh crap. I don't I don't think I click Blaze I don't think I click any of these here. Maybe I uh, no, I, I think I click Mega Mimic here. I think I click Mega Mimic here so you don't die to Spice Mocos, because this can help you get that kill on. Moose Charm is actively terrible here. Okay, we just take the Lumen Goop and the Crown. Uh, unfortunate. Unfortunate. Okay, we crown. We'll crown Tala here, take Spike out of the build. And I probably should play Momo. Getting the. I think we will, like, with Bonelda's Teeth generation, I think we'll have a fairly easy time getting to King Mocha. Getting to King Mo. Okay, maybe not with this. Against these enemies. Okay, immediate Kek Fez here is what you want. Okay. So I need to play out this hand. Ah, oh, God. I need to greasy pop frog here. Okay. Play... I will hit Grumps here because there's a good chance. Gr there's honestly a good ch chance Grumps is going to be attacking here. Shotgun to the face. I will just shotgun to the face this Grog. And this whole bottom lane dies to Sentient Punching Bag. Alright, well, now looking at it, there was not much reason to play to hit the Grumps here. But you know what? Bone Elda is going to go off. Because then I get to do something like this. It demonizes. And then, like, it's 13 teeth. Is that more teeth? Yeah, that's 8 teeth I just generated. It's not too bad. Oh, huh, I, I can't hit either of you. You guys. Alright. Make sure you are saving your durability on Mega Mimic. I do not need to play... Uh, okay, I'll baseball bat, baseball bat the goblin here. Oh, you start with barrage. 
Huh. <laughs> I don't know why that... That is just now occurring to me. Alright. I think I should try to not greed here. Okay. You immediately killed this mini Melko. I could- wait, what I could do here is I could just save Mega Mimic's durability. I could. And you know what? This is what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna fucking hit King Moko here. With the bone needles. With the bonitas. And I think that will be good. And then I can just go for like a three damage swing. Or I can, like, Frosty Mint. That fucking Makoko just dies immediately. Oh, wait, shit, I lost block here. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. I can lose Momo here. If I don't think I have the ability to kill... If I don't think I have the ability to kill King Moko here. And honestly, with the Demon Eyes, I probably will be able to kill King Moko here. Yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. Actually, we kind of dominated King Moko here, which is funny. I thought we were going to really struggle against King Moko here because our units had such high turn counters. But with the Mona, it's kind of perfect. Very happy with this top half of the removal. Greasy Pop Hyper Burn. Apply 3 Overburn. Increase HP by 3. No thanks. <laughs> that doesn't sound very good to me. Okay, I'm gonna take Momo off the squad at this point. Oh, I should put this on... Oh, wait, this is also good to put on Kekfez, actually. Because at the start of a fight, I can get four block on Bonelda. Or Bonelda. Oh, that's really good, act. Oh, that's really good, actually. Because then I also just bon Bonelda immediately triggers. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. I'm gonna take that. I think that's probably better. Two block is probably better than the pink berry juice. I think that's pretty damn strong. I don't have the money for a charm merchant. Their card removal is just better here. Hit him with the baseball bat. I can't imagine I see too much here. I could take Raven here. I should just click Raven here. Raven here to just make see if you can make some extra money. You do have the demon eyes to make it possible. Okay. This this in four block on Banelda. I will play this here. I can never get critical on the fucking bone needles because I have this mini goop here. God damn it, that's really bad. Ah, fucking disasters of critic. Of oh, I'm gonna go through this fucking block so quickly, aren't I? Oh no! Oh no! Oh, brother. <laughs> this guy stinks. Our saving grace here is that we're gonna ha is that we have Demona's demon eyes. All right, we are still building good good teeth. In fact, I could do this here to kill the actually just kill the Bigfoot. Which seems good to me. Grumble is close to dying. I get a bone needle to just straight up kill the Grumble. Throw this here. Because it's better on Demona because Demona has the shorter turn counter. So I'm not building as much teeth, but it doesn't really matter because you are hitting 12 teeth. You are hitting the breakpoint of 12 teeth here. And then I can get out Raven here to just try to make some extra money. Wooly Drek does have Barrage, which you need to be 
very careful about. You need to be very mindful of that factor. So I think what I want to do here is that I should try to save some... Some block on Bonelda here. Or save the hit up block we have on Bonelda here. It is gonna mean... Actually, I am just kind of killing... Huh. I am just kind of... God, this run is actually just being carried by this Demona. What the hell? Demona is going absolutely insane this run. You'll love to see it. Demona, not a unit you usually see, like, go insane, insano style. Love to see an underdog get their day. Alright. I will play a damage sentient punching bag here. Very happy to have Raven in this setup to just allow us to make some extra money here. Uh... Uh, I will do something like this. Does this apply demonize? It does not, unfortunately. Although I am just, I'm just killing the Bigfoot, huh? <laughs> so look at that. Bigfoot just dies. And Bonella just keeps scaling. Huh. Quite, quite interesting, I... Curious. Curious indeed. You know, with Bonella not really, like, attacking for much i might just be able to sit in this combat for a little bit to just allow raven to make me money raven this unit is fucking insane this unit bonkers yeah i will just recall although i i want to play demonize here i will just like eh. Eh. it's fine Okay, you go for a greasy pop play here. You get the demon eyes. Good job, Raven. Just keep making, just keep making me money, buddy. Buddy, just make me money. You go for the chili willy on, on our man's here, and then you just fucking greasy pop. That's demon eyes. That's a huge amount of money. That Raven makes us. Fucking $85? This unit's crazy. I, like, did no special setups for Raven. And I was still... Oh, I should have taken the... I got this... Uh, I think I made the wrong decision here. Nutty Peanut. Uh... This would have been really good if I put Aimless on this. Mm. I don't think that's good enough. Or not, it really good if I saved the critical charm for that. Not aimless, that wouldn't make... Smack back! You say. Oh my god. <laughs> Smack back means we're able to foster absurd an absurd amount of shit teeth on Bonelda here. Oh my. Now I'm on part of me is sake nah I don't need balance balance charm is silly here. Blaze T <laughs> Good Do I have the crown to crowns to play it though? Strawberry charm, very good. I think I do. I think I will take this option. Cause it also means. Oh wait. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it, the blaze tea is still good. I don't think it's like amazing, but I probably. It's basically the same as playing Lumen Base, so it's fine. We're just trying to get extra triggers off Bonelda here. This run is so cool. I this run is awesome. We're actually doing a teeth build, and it doesn't. Oh my god, the the berry, the fucking 
bit of berry we got here is amazing because it means it means Bonelda is not dying. And like if Bonelda's not dying, then like we're pogging. Simple science, really. Oh fuck, I just I remember I can't Ugh god, this combat's really awkward. I might honestly just recall it because I don't this clan does not have the ability to freeze Krunker with your starting cards. Because you need to think you need to restore HP to the Krunkers, to Krunker, in order to, in order to be able to heal off it. Alright, he, what I need to do here, honestly, I just need to set up Bonelda. You must set up the, you must set up the Bone Lady. Yeah, cause then we smack back, and then we go again, and then, like, <laughs> it's the fucking... It's the goddamn nuke build all over again that that we did in fucking Bloom Frost. Holy shit, man! And again, we got Demona on this board, baby. We got fucking Demona here, who's just gonna come in and make it so each one of these bone needles applies demonized, and then we're just gonna go through the fucking roof. It's amazing, honestly. It's a fucking wonder. This gobbler can definitely kill you if you let Benelda smack back into it. Although, hold up here. Doesn't Krunker hit somebody else on this board? I'm pretty sure. I'll switch the units around like this. Alright, we now got critical. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Everybody gather around, because we're about to see Bonelda go crazy here. How much teeth can we get? We play every single one of these bone needles. Oh my god. It, it's crazy. I... Alright, no. It, we got through it because it's, it's Krunker. I, I, I killed Krunker. I killed Kr Krunker. I don't give a shit that you're hitting all my guys here. I don't fucking give a damn. I don't give it. Oh, wait. No, I'm not getting critical shit. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, my God. I... We have recurred... Up here... Procured... 85, 83 teeth in one, 83 teeth, oh my god, it's fucking get, you would not believe it. <laughs> This mod's crazy! Look at all these bone needles! It's, this is the fucking nuke build all over again that we did in Bloom Frost, man. Oh, I might just take this on... I think I should take this on... Oh, uh... Mm, no, yeah, I do. Because what I can do here is that I can Frozen Heart Bonelda. Get that to block at the start. And then I can click Sun Bell. Although I could have also clicked Spark... Yeah, no, that's fine. It's fine. Oh my god, we're gonna eat the wild hogs alive in this combat. We're gonna eat the little hoggy woggies alive. Now, Bono Bon Bonelda is starting with. You know, Bonelda, the more I say it, I feel like I'm gonna slip into like Bonita. You look very Bon. How's the fucking clip go again? I feel bony tough. Or something like that. Ah, the fucking hog with the annoying ass hog. Okay. Make sure you're playing your other units first. I can probably just take Tala out of this deck. I have Tala in this deck. All that I need is Demona. Demona's the legitimate. Demona is what enables this whole run. Which is not a. 
sentence that you usually get to say. It's it's a sentence you only you get to say. This fight actually could be kind of rough because I'm gonna blow through all my block kind of quick here, which is unfortunate. And I don't have a good. I really need to build up Bonelda's teeth here before I can fight the Warthogs. It's definitely kind of scary. And I'm not getting smack- or am I getting smack back? I should check to see if it works like this. I sup- eh. Let's let this turn go through. I don't die here though, do I? Okay, I don't- I don't even- I don't- I do not generate the- all right, this fight could get weird. This fight could get very strange. If I'm not careful. Because we don't have very much snow against the Warthogs. Although I do have Mega Mimic here to help me kill this Warthog. Which is, honestly, very appreciated. Thank you. Uh, now we're getting to like, the situation where I need... Do I have enough? I can probably just... Gun it for the kill on the on this warthog. I should play this bone needle first, then you use the higher damage needle, and then you just like, and then you just kill, and then then warthog is just dead. Then you have bone bonelda going off here, just getting crazy amount. Uh, do this, then you can do go for a sugar shine here. And it looks fine to me. I still got block left over. Two block is probably all I need to- is probably all I'm gonna need to fight. It is all I'm really gonna need for my fight against, uh, also, uh, eight bone needles any- eight bone needles anybody? Hmm. Going once, going twice. Eight bone needles for anyone. Okay. We got the setup. We're here. I'll play a special tomato here on Raven because it means you're gonna make a lot of money here. I will snow this warthog. Okay, and looking at it, it is probably a case we're trying we're going for the criticals here is probably unnecessary but is it cool yes so therefore it's required damn's the rules because now now uh bam bam i might just kill razor down outright with the bow needles i might just kill i might just I will just kill Bone Ra Razor with the Bone Needles. I don't even need the teeth. The amount of damage, like single target damage we get with Demona is crazy. Lovely shop here. Very happy to be able to duplicate my... Well, all in one. Apply two snow, apply three ink, apply four poison, apply three over overburn, apply two demonize, apply three. Apply three bomb, apply three frost, apply one haze. Whoa. <laughs> All in one. Snowball charm, pretty okay. Frenzy charm. Not really much I'm able to do with this. I probably will just put this on pink berry juice. Eh, this seems good on that. This vase, this goes on you. Oh, I did have another crown I could have played this run. Huh. I didn't really think of that. It's fine. Uh, this crown... I suppose I will just put on pink berry juice. 
And I'll give Bonell the, the ability to play some snow. It's fine. I will, t and I will be clicking all in one here. Because it looks fun. Alright, we will duplicate the Kekfez. Because that's just more, that's more survivability, which is mainly what you need here. Alright, get down you. Luminvase Bonelda. Kekfez. Blaze Tea. Pinkberry Juice. Look at this fucking insano unit. I'm kind of down to do this. Yo, look at all those sad effect. That's awesome. That's amazing. I love that. Should I go for? I should just. I should be trying to play out this hand. Uh, I don't actually mind the Mega Mimic hitting me. You know why? Why don't I mind the Mega Mimic hitting me? Well. Very simple reason. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> Keep, keep it going. Keep the, keep the train fucking going, man. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the best Wild Frost mod, man. The game is actually slowing down. The game is ac it's actually taking longer for the enemies to arrive. What the fuck? <laughs> The game is actually slowing down. That's, that's not supposed to happen. <laughs> that, 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 that's, that's not. The game is, this is the first time the game is, I think I've ever had a Wild Frost actually slow down on me. And it's like weird because it's not like the game, like the frame rate I'm pretty sure is fine. It's just like, Make sure I am recording. The frame weight, frame, frame weight, I'm pretty sure is fine. But, like, the issue is, I think I just win the fight here. I think I don't even need to play the teeth here. I just win through bow needles. <laughs> I, I actually don't need to play anything. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are. Here we are with a teeth build. A once in a something that has I thought was like not really feasible. It's like it's actually just taking. Do you see this shit? It's taking longer for like the enemies to arrive. Like they're not funneling in as quickly. That's so bizarre. God, pretty sure I'm gonna like actually crash the game. God, imagine that. Like, I actually, I, <laughs> this is fucking, this is so fucked up. Oh, uh, I love units that are like, I love, love, love units that say add, add a card to your hand because you're able to just get really fucking bonkers run. No, call in the enemies here. Yeah, fucking get, you guys get in here. I'm, we're getting, we're making this amount of teeth higher. Can we get much higher? So high. Okay, this is as far as it goes. Actually, wait, can I play this on Mega Mimic? Oh, I can. I can play it on Mega Mimic. And then I'll also play one on Demona. Okay. Ooh, almost 200 teeth. So close. Yeah, this is a pretty good thumb. This is a pretty good thumbnail. This looks pretty good. <laughs> and I'll also take a screenshot of Demona here. Frost Guardian, go ahead. Go ahead! 
<laughs> Go ahead, Frost Guardian. See what happens. <laughs> Minus 391 health. No, oh my god. <laughs> that was pretty cool. That was pretty cool, wasn't it? <laughs> In your deck. So this will not affect the bone needles. I think I'll take a breakfast sun bell so I can get a second Kek Fez. Or get another... Oh! Oh my god. I always forget this act... This sucked. This sucked. I literally always forget that breakfast char... That breakfast sun bell fucks up. Breakfast sun bell fucks up strawberry charm. I, I literally always forget that it works like that because fucking... Breakfast Charm is worth- is- might be the worst bell. Fucking annoying. Alright, we must begin to play- play out this hand. Sentient Punching Bag can go in the back. I have- look, we have one thing of block, and there is- we have- or we have six- like points of block and six units in this fight. That's all I need. I only need six hits to. All right, I don't even need that because once I get critical on these, it's all over. It it it's Jover. Act. Um. I can't move my units. Shit. <laughs> Fucking fine. You know what? I don't even care. Hit me. Hit me, see what happens. You won't like me when you when I'm angry. <laughs> so what do you think about it? This is more of like a teeth build by proxy. Because it's not like the teeth that are making this run fucking bonkers. Oh yeah, I have the okay, wait. I need to play snow here. Oh shit, the sentient punching bag, bag explodes. Okay, then... <laughs> oh, this, you know, this kind of, this is annoying because I don't get critical on all of them. Because of this fucking infinity sun bell. How annoying. Anyway, uh, don't recall Demona because you need Demona's doubling. Oh my god. <laughs> It's so crazy. <laughs> it's so insane. It's um, awesome. I I just have a huge smile on my face right now. This is amazing. Just kill fucking throw bones at at Frost Crusher until he dissolves away. <laughs> I officially have enough. All right, I could just sit here and play and play these fucking bone needles on every unit in this fight until they eventually all die. But yeah, you, you, we all, we all want to watch these bones kill. Actually, I think I need to kill the Frost Junker because the Frost Junker actually threatens me with, like, actual damage. Alright, no. And then, we have scaled our teeth. Now it, we will just be clicking the redraw bell. Oh my- Look how slow it is! Look how slow it is! That's not right, man. That's fucked. That's fucked up. That, that shit ain't right, Chief. Oh wait, I didn't kill you. <laughs> Oops. Alright, you know what? Now I'll just play Kek Fez again. And that will give me enough. No! I'm, I'm generating more bone needles! I'm generating more bone needles. And now Frost Jailer- okay. Frost Junker, just let yourself die. Oh my god, look at this! Look how long it takes me to redraw! 
Looks how it, it's 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 bonkers. It's Google D bonkers, even. All right now we just wait for the rest of these enemies to die. Now, I could just kill all these guys with bone needles, but come on, we we want to watch the Frost Brigade fumble the teeth, fall the get fucking just touch my bonelda and they just like, get fucking disintegrated. That's what we really want to see. Oh wait, this is not possible. This is bon Bonelda. All right, it might not be possible to let the... Is it possible to let the frost... Okay, hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. I need... I need... We need to get the kill with teeth. This needs to happen. So I think what I need to do... Oh my god, I was gonna say like... Oh, I'll redraw for the card in my deck. That like increases their turn counter. <laughs> Wait a minute. I didn't get it. Ah. Alright. I will be a if I wanna get let get it so Frostmuncher dies to teeth, it's just gonna take a long time. So I'm just gonna We'll just take the kill here. I don't actually get the kill with a bone needle. I kill with a baseball bat to fucking bash your teeth in. Bash your weirdly large teeth in, Frost Muncher. This run was fucking awesome. Holy shit. <laughs> Bonelda. Let Bonelda fucking win crazy. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Fucking tore this world asunder. We finally got a teeth build in... In a modded run, uh, I, this was again more of a teeth build by proxy because bone it was like the bone needles that did all the damage and not the teeth. But uh, yeah, that was pretty cool, wasn't it? <laughs> this mod's awesome, man. Holy shit! Holy shit, man! This mod is awesome. This mod is crazy cool. Ah, anyway. <laughs> That's gonna be this episode of Wild Trust. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to like, comment, and oversubscribe. And all of you out there, have a nice day.